I'm Corinne. I'm Thomas. Good morning, welcome to the Chill Spot. My name's Drake, I'm the Member Service Director here at NACA, and this is our Treasurer from the Board, Corinne. Good morning. Today, as many of you know that have been watching the show, some shows back we were going to do a membership giveaway for someone who shared our segment, and we want to do that giveaway today. And I just want to talk a little bit about it first. Our membership here at NACA is $30 a year. And I, I'm not going to list every single thing it includes, but I'm going to hit some of the highlights. 12 hours of mandated education, discount on our pro shop, and discount on CNA Fest. So who we're about to give this membership to will have all of those benefits. And my hope is that she will take this membership and spread the word to other people that she knows. Right. And Corinne, you know her, right? Yeah, I had the opportunity to meet her about six months ago, and she was actually working in dietary and wanted to move on to the floor. So she actually took the course, a CMA, and she passed it. And her name is Patriva Bradley from Rolla, Missouri. Patriva Bailey? Bailey. Yeah. Did I say that wrong? You said Bradley, but it's okay. Patriva oh. Bradley <laughs> is what you said. Patriva <laughs> Bailey is the name. Yeah, I'm kind of nervous. It's okay, though. Because she has no ideal, so I'm kind of nervous just Yeah, that's good, though. And congratulations her. to her, for sure. Yeah. And she works at AmeriCare Assistant um, Living oh, there nice. in Rolla, Missouri. And she is just an awesome person. You know, um, she already has um, the trust of all of the, her residents there mm -hmm. from being in dietary. And she never complains. She always has a big smile on her face. Good. And one thing that I notice is she doesn't um, stand above them. She'll get down on their level and make that eye oh, contact. Oh, great. That's a big thing. Yeah. Yeah. So um, congratulations. Sorry for messing up your name, but... I was a little bit nervous presenting it to her because she's going to be so so excited. Yeah, and I'm when excited. She finds out. I love when you know, well, anything, a nice gesture or anything like that. But being granted membership for a year, that's huge to me. This year will give her the time to evaluate membership, see if this is something that is going to fit with her, and hopefully, in the coming years, she will pay for her membership and continue to be a NACA member from here until forever. Yeah, she even mentioned um, that she was going to go talk to her administrator about supporting her and sponsoring her to go to CNA Fest. Oh, even better. So, yeah, even better. She's really excited. So congratulations to her. And then the other thing I, we wanted to touch base on, a big thing, how I started in this industry, volunteering. And this month is National Volunteer Month. Yeah. So I just wanted to, well, I'm going to let you give some ideas on volunteering because I did that on a previous show. So they know mine, I think. Well, I actually um, volunteer at the Missouri Veterans Home also and through AmeriCare. And it's, it's a different experience that you have going in. You're not in your uniform versus going there to work and earning that, that mm -hmm. paycheck. And the residents um, see you in a different setting also because they're like, oh, you came in just for me and you're not yeah. working today. Yep. And their face lights up. But there, you can go in, uh, volunteer to read a newspaper to them, um, play cards, play checkers, go to happy hour with them. Just Down go for and, that one. Yeah, <laughs> just go and set and visit with them. They love the one-on-one -on -one attention. Mm -hmm. um, if you choose not to volunteer in one of your facilities, there is so many other ones that you can go in. Now, some places do require you to fill out an application. Yes, yeah, they wanna know who's in their building for sure. Yeah. So it, it's a great way to get out there. Even for someone who's thinking about being a CNA, you can volunteer and see if that's right mm -hmm. for you. For sure. Get the whole atmosphere. And so I loved volunteering in the buildings and I still do. If you're someone who wants a change of scenery and you still want to volunteer, mm -hmm. Humane Society, mm -hmm. Animal Shelter, um, a meal service program that maybe feeds the homeless at night. They're always looking for servers. 
You can check into like your local homeless shelters. There are other volunteer opportunities other than nursing homes. Volunteer HQ is a headquarters that lists volunteer stuff through every state. And I'm often checking on there just to see the different kind of things you can do. Another one that's really is in need of male volunteers, Boys and Girls Club Big Brother Big Sister program. Yeah. Every single state is low on male big brothers. So if that's something, you know, you take a day out of your week and you go do something fun, play mini golf, go to a movie with this little brother that you will gain. So it's a feel good thing for you and it's feel good for them. So just some different ideas on how to volunteer, give back to your community and make a difference. Yeah, definitely. Because it's kind of a win-win a situation. Mm -hmm. You win, but then they also win. Right. You know, so it, it's a, it's a good uh, program. The one that you just mentioned, the Boys and Girls. Yeah, Boys and Girls Club. I always love. I always loved them. <laughs> and if you also have um, a YMCA, you can probably check yep. out that. You sure can. Um, library is a good one to go in there and volunteer to read to some of the the kids and stuff. So um, just remember to get out there, and when you do go out there, let them know um, right up front what, how many hours you can volunteer yes. where there's no misunderstanding. Um, don't make a commitment of volunteering if you can't fulfill that commitment. Of course, yeah. Because you could be taking that slot away from somebody else that would really want to do that certain activity with them. But um, other than that, just... Um, Get out there, put yourself out there, and think outside the box. And yeah. if you guys have any ideas about volunteering, please reach out to us and make sure you read um, the Naka Edge because For you sure. put that out, and yep. there was a volunteer article about that. And um, until you see Drake and I again, remember, remember that you matter. You matter. <laughs>